Hello and welcome to the first secret level of Wolfenstein 3D Ultimate Challenge, Floor 19, The Annihilation Zone. Whether it's me who's going to be annihilated or the Nazis yet, I'm not entirely sure. You'll have to wait and see. Now, we've got several paths to choose from at the beginning here. I'm going to go this way first. Now, there are several paths through this level. This one is going to end in a locked door, a door which I could have opened if I'd gone and got the key from the other path first. But like I said, because there are several paths, I'm going to go all the dead ends first and then just take the most, I don't know, linear path I could take. Now, as soon as I open this door, there's going to be a bat that right behind me. The first bat of Ultimate Challenge. I don't know why they always choose to introduce them in the secret level and then have none for until what, from 11 or something. Several guys on the right there. I'll just wait here for a second. I can see another guard moving around the far end of the room. Take him off. And go around collecting what was happening. Oh! Is he still alive or was that someone else? I'm not sure. Get all this. And head back this way. Now I'm going to go to the right first here. No one was around that time. I heard that shoe stuff over there. Is. Sometimes what can happen is a shoe stuff will go into this corner here. I actually saw two come around here earlier on, so I was kind of pretty sure that there wasn't going to be anyone that side this time around. There is a couple guards left in here, I think. There's one. Did someone else come through here? No, okay, we're good. Now, there are a couple doors that way. They both go to the same room, but we're going to go to this way first. Shoot stuff on the right here. Yeah, yeah. Them. Sneak up on the second door. Turn to the left and get the first secret of Ultimate Challenge. Or no, of this floor, I should say. And it gives us an extra life. There's a medic on the floor here. We may need to come back to that because we have quite a challenging room ahead of us. Now, I'm going to go through this door first. They both go to the same one. You can see the other door on the right here. And around the corner on the left are half a dozen shoe stuff all. What I'm going to do is run past all of them, engage the one guy at the far end of the room, then turn around into the only entrance into yeah, this yeah, center yeah, area. Yeah. That way I can pick them off as they come through here. Okay, that's then dispatched without any trouble at all. If you don't know about that, it's very easy to get overwhelmed here. Here's that locked door I mentioned much earlier. It's going to lead into the red area of this map. We're not ready to deal with that though. Again, it is gonna. I have the gold key, but we need the iron key to go through that door. The gold key is only useful right at the very end. I'm a bit lost. There we go. Right, let's head backwards. Uh, I don't need either of that. We're gonna go straight on there, skip over that door, and come this way. Again, this is another path that's gonna end in an iron locked door, but I don't want to go that way just yet. It's just stuff right at the end of the room now, that's not the first of all. Bats on the left, guards on the right, bats on the far end of the room, 49 bullets. None of this is ideal. I need to grab some ammo. Let's move in. Now, in the corners here are two plates of food and treasure that are easily missed. Speaking of easily missed, there are three bits in the middle. Now there is a pool of blood there, but there isn't actually a secret this time around. I'm going to go through the rightmost door here. Turn to my right to make sure there is no guards down here. This time there's two, that's kind of uncommon, but whatever. We'll move around the room. There's that other iron lock door. I expect a few bats around here. Then we'll make it into that center room. And we've got all this stuff now. Now there's a pool of blood on the ground. Another secret just here. Move in, grab all this treasure. Uh, I think we are done here now. Yes, we are. Okay, we can leave. Who was he? He must have come through that middle room while we were around one of the edges. Not entirely sure where he came from. Anyway, let's head right back to the beginning. Pick up this while we were close. I think there was a chest of ammo there. Yes, there was. In fact, there was even more ammo around here, wasn't there? Okay, good. We're in a good, strong place now. This is where we began from. We're going to go straight through this door now. Come this way. I'll leave all that. We will go back to grab it in a second, I'm sure, because this next room is the most challenging. Or rather, the room that's directly after. There are many, many shoes to fall in here. There's one coming from my left right now. Okay, maybe not. I think I got lucky there and both of them came around the right hand side. Let's move through this room. Pick up. I think he came from outside. All that. 
and there are several plates of food in the middle of this room as well. Let's go another one down for right now. I would rather go left first, actually. Him. Oh my god, a pair of pets in there. And pool of blood, yet again, marks a secret. It's another extra life, so I'll save it till the end. Anyone in this middle room? Nope. Just checking there's no one in here. Now, watch out for this trio of bats around this next corner here. There's two, there's another one. Got another room to clear out here, though. There's four shoes stuff on here. What I'm going to do is shoot the one on the left, then turn around behind me, and then... Yeah, 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 yeah. It's two down. Now wait for the other two to turn up. Okay, and that's this room cleared out. Grab the treasure. And finally, we have the iron key. We've seen, what, four doors now that require it. But we have it in our possession. So let's go and grab that extra life. And before we leave this blue zone behind us forever, we'll go and grab the ammo at the end here. So that is pretty much the first half of this mission complete. The red zone is a lot shorter. The first couple rooms here, it's like a, I don't know how to describe it, layers of just these long red rooms here. This one's a bit more challenging with more guys. And several rooms ahead of us have been alerted as well. Straight through. Okay, we're good. Let's go through the left one here. Now, this gold door here is the one that progresses to the end, but we have several rooms to take out behind us here. So we'll do them first. And this leads back to the blue zone. here? Nope. I think it will be in this room. Perhaps not. Okay, again, this is gonna go back to the blue zone. Got one final area. Shoot stuff at the end of the room here. Close on him. And we've got a secret in this room. It's gonna have a whole heap of treasure right at the end. All gun. that as well. Okay, red zone is complete. Much, much shorter than the blue zone. We're going into the final area here now. We'll have this on the right. There is indeed a pool of blood and a secret behind us, but I'll go forwards just for two seconds here. Now, there's two rooms to the left and to the right. Each contains three guards, and as soon as you open one, the other door behind you is going to open as well. So we'll take out them. And then you'll see two rooms ahead of us contain a pair of rats. We're going to come back to those rats in a second. Behind us, we have a secret we skipped over. Just here. And this is going to lead us, if I can find the secret, on a long trail of secrets. This pile of skulls here, I think it's the first time we're seeing it outside of like the hell dimension at the very end. Now there's a secret on the right hand side here. We're seeing both blood and rats being used to mark secrets here. One on the left, and another one behind us there, we'll get in a second. Got that extra life, why not? damage there. I wish I had that extra life. We'll move on. Hope for the best. Down this winding path. Oh, I uh, skipped over a room. In fact, I skipped over several, didn't I? I didn't um, show you. This moves as well into a room we were in previously. If you remember around here, we came around and opened the door on the right. And there's a secret just here. 
should have got this one earlier, but never mind. Since this one loops back, that actually kind of worked out kind of nice. Now let's move on. That's the final secret in this chain here. In here. Finally a little bit of health. And you may remember this room here and this one with a pair of rats. We were in much earlier, so we can move on. And we've got quite a tough area ahead of us. Move in here. Oh, we should have gone left first here. It was a mistake on my part. Come to the end and deal with any enemies from this direction. Move around here. I think the two bats wait for you in there, but they came out this time. Good stuff. Got supplies. Got interesting area here we're about to go into. We've got numerous guards coming from the end of this long line of corridor. And through all these gaps on the right hand side there are several bats and officers as well. We're going to run through here as quick as possible. Because it's better to engage them from that corridor. There is one secret behind us. Might as well grab it now. As an extra light. But I don't think this area is quite as difficult as they expected it to be. There is one random bat. Oh my god. Damage there. Again, move through here quick to make sure that the guys don't shoot you through the gaps. Okay, made me jump there. Can we shoot stuff or come through this door any second? Watch out for bats. We have two lives here, but loads of guys as well. Yeah, that reminds me of Doom 2 there. So many infantry will get mowed down by the chain gun. Extra lives I might as well grab now, why not? Don't want to forget about them, because I need it for treasure score. There'll be one more guy at the end here. Someone in this final room? If there was someone in that room. Okay. He shouldn't have been in there. He, I don't know how he's ended up here. He must have travelled a really long way. Anyway, here we are at the very end of the level. Let's grab all this stuff. Full health and ammo. And that is the end of the first secret floor of Ultimate Challenge. It says secret tunnel area complete, but this was the Annihilation Zone. Again, just like Return of Danger, all the end screens for the boss levels and the secret levels are going to be lifted straight from Spirit Destiny. But, thank you very much for watching. I will be back tomorrow at 2 o'clock for the first boss level of Ultimate Challenge.